Hello everyone and welcome to Black Star Potential. My name is Lee Fuge and I'm here today with MusicTeacher.com. In this video I'm going to be showing you how to combine cab rig with a real cabinet, whether that's live or in the studio. So for this I'm using the Black Star Amped 2, which I've got set up with just kind of a basic rock tone that just kind of works for all purposes. Now I'm running this in two different ways today. So I'm going out of the XLR output on the back, which is the cab rig output, and that's going straight into the front of my audio interface. Now, if I come over to Architect, this is the cab rig setup that I'm currently using. So I'm using a 212 Classic UK Combo with a 421 dynamic mic, and it's on access. This is the EQ that I'm using, and I've got a medium room sound dialed in as well. Now, what I'm also doing is I've also got this cable connected, which is going out of the speaker output. And this is where you would connect this to a real cabinet, but I'm actually using the Two Notes Torpedo Captor X. And on that, I'm running another 2x12 cabinet in another medium room, but with a different speaker set and a different mic set. So the whole idea behind that is, let's imagine I'm using this as my live amp, and it's sitting on top of a real speaker cabinet, which is being occupied by the IR from the Two Notes. So let's say that is my real on-stage speaker cabinet that I'm using for my on-stage sound, but it's also mic'd up going to front of house or in the studio. And then I'm also running out of the XLR on here into cab rig. So I'm actually feeding two different signals either to the producer or to the front of house engineer. Now what that allows me to do is get a really wide sound with two different layered guitar parts, which will sound slightly different. This is a great way to really thicken up your guitar tone. So I've actually got these panned hard left and right. So if you're listening on headphones, everything you hear on the left side is going to be cab rig, and everything you hear on your right side is going to be the Captor X. So both of those are running in parallel with each other, so you'll hear two different cabinet sounds as I play. So first of all, here is the cab rig sound. So this will come out of the left speaker. So that is entirely cab rig. Now you're gonna hear just the right side, which is the two notes, which would be my real on stage cabinet. So those are two very different cab sounds, but they both sound great in isolation. Now where this setup really comes in handy is if you're gigging or you're in the studio and you want a really thick layered guitar sound. So now what you're going to hear is both at the same time. So we're still in the same setup, you've still got cab rig on the left side and the two notes on the right side, but you're going to hear a blend of the two speakers now. This is going to sound fatter and wider and a little bit more double tracked because it kind of sounds like I've added a second guitar part to this. So there you go, there is a really cool and simple way to run your amped product 
and use cab rig with a real speaker cabinet or another IR, because if you don't have a two-notes torpedo capture X, you can use any IR loader for this. Or you could run that cable straight into a second input in audio interface and use another digital cab sim, such as the cab rig that's built into the Blackstar St. James amp suite. That could also be used as a plug-in with that direct signal as well. So you can basically use whatever cab sim you want in the same way with the cab rig on the amp too and get a really wide sound. This works great live as well. You can have a mic'd cabinet on stage, pair that with cab rig, and you can have these two contrasting cab sounds, which you can pan hard left and right through the PA like I've done in this video to get a really wide fat sound. This is also a great way to expand your sound if you're the only guitar player in a band as well. It kind of gives you like a fake sense of stereo or like a fake double tracking. It can work great in those situations. Let me know down below if you guys are using any of these kind of methods in your own sound. I'd love to hear how you guys are using your amp rig in your own setup. Don't forget to check out Blackstar Amplification on YouTube for more videos just like this. And if you're looking for a music teacher in your local area, please head over to musicteacher.com. It's a great network of teachers all around the UK waiting to help you guys out. Thank you so much for watching as always. I'll see you soon.